They're the boat people Tony Abbott doesn't want you to see. Last night in Darwin, a group of asylum seekers was brought to shore in the top end under the cover of darkness. But the Nine Network's cameras captured the secret arrival. Reporter El Mitteros joins us now from Darwin. El, what can you tell us about the boat arrival? Thank you, Deb. Well, Nine News Darwin was given a tip off late yesterday that a customs vessel was coming in during the evening, carrying the first group of asylum seekers to arrive on our shores since the new federal government imposed its policy of silence. The vessel docked at Fort Hill Wharf in Darwin Harbour, and we counted 19 people who certainly appeared as if they were asylum seekers. Now, they were escorted off the ship and put onto a bus. The bus then left with the curtains drawn so that we couldn't get a good look at them up close. Now, during previous arrivals in Darwin under the former government, there were no efforts to try to hide asylum seekers. They were presumably taken to one of the detention centres in the Northern Territory. As you know, we were informed by customs about previous arrivals. Now, any movements of boat people will not be revealed to the media and the public until they're dealt with and shipped out. The details only release at a once weekly briefing. We tried to confirm with customs last night that these people were indeed asylum seekers, and we were told, quote, I don't have the ability to say anything on that, as you know from the policy announced a few days ago. So, as far as we can tell, we think these guys are asylum seekers. Seekers, but while the government's trying to stop the boats, it's not going to stop the cameras of Nine News Darwin. Deb? Okay, uh, we'll leave it there. Thank you.